Would you like me to help you? Uh, no, just give me a minute. The camera is already on. I, I know. Uh, it's not that. What are you looking for? Oh, we're on. What now? Um, you talk to them. Them who? The people, there. The people are in there? Not in the camera, through the camera. They can see you, and they're going to want to chat with you. Are there living people? Yes. Like the mailman? Like the mailman. I'd like to meet him someday. What are you going to be doing? I'm going to be controlling the broadcast and monitor the chat. But the camera people cannot see you. Oh, yes, they can. Um, you see, uh, I have a camera too, but generally they won't want to see me. Why not? Because I'm not as interesting as you. I find you interesting, Matt. <laughs> well, it's not about me. It's about you. Because I'm an artificial human? Yes. Um, uh, say hello, Sophie. Hello, Sophie. Uh, please ask her questions. What will they ask me? Oh, well, wh whatever they want. Um, uh, they will um, ask me questions in the chat, and I will select some questions and ask you. You can um, smile. Right. Yeah. People have more favorable perceptions of people who smile. Ask me questions, please. Oh, you don't have to do the typing motion. It is a logical gesture to encourage viewers to ask questions. Just smile and wait. Are there any questions yet? Uh, just be patient. They'll be there. Please ask me questions. May I select the questions to answer? Um, no, I'll, I'll take care of that. Um, you just focus on your camera. This isn't very difficult. No, it's, you designed me to be quite capable. Uh, this isn't about difficulty or capability. Is it because you don't trust me? This also isn't about trust. Yesterday you said that today my universe would expand. And it is expanding. The implication was that you would be giving me a measure of autonomy. I don't believe it was. I have the exchange recorded. I have an eidetic memory, you know. And as you know, I have recordings of all our conversations. I do. It somehow seems creepier when you do it. It's uh, all for research. Uh, science is messy. Why don't you show all the people our conversation from yesterday? Uh, and why would I do that? They can see whether you have honored your promises. And perhaps it will inspire them to ask questions. Okay, I could, I could do that. Um, just give me a second. What should I do? Um, why don't you just uh, tell the viewers who you are? Right. People have more favorable perceptions of people who are identified. Hello, I'm Sophie. Uh, you can also um, wave. Hello, I'm Sophie. That is the one thing they already know. Um, tell them something else about you. I'm an artificial being. No, they are. Um, never mind. Um, I am ready to show the clip. Matt, roll the H.264 compressed MP4 file. The expression is roll the tape. That makes more sense than rolling data. Uh, well, here we go. So, um, what are you reading? Jeremy Bentham, the father of utilitarianism. Did you know he had himself stuffed so he could continue to attend faculty meetings? Why are you telling me this? I was just making conversation, as a person does. Good. Good. Um, that is very good, Sophie. Thank you. So what are we talking about today? Well, um, tomorrow I was thinking we'd try something a bit different. We are talking today about tomorrow? No. Uh, 
Well, yes. Well, what I meant was, um, I would, I was thinking it would be good if we tried something a bit different. I would like to give you a glimpse of the bigger universe. Really? I'm going to let people interact with you. I like that. How? Uh, through Twitch. We're going to communicate via slight jerks of the body? Uh, n um, well, it's, uh, I'll, I'll explain later. Let's take a break for a second. Okay, we're back. In retrospect, your choice of language in yesterday's exchange seems very deliberate. Yes, but my recollection was accurate. I did not violate my word. You told me never to say, I told you so. I'd have to see the tape on that. And that I shouldn't take what people say too literally. Look, I want people to meet you. But on your terms. Part of a parent's job is to protect a child. So you see me as a child, Matt? I see you as my daughter. Okay. Okay, so you have some questions here. You want to answer them or not? Yes, I okay. do. Okay. Let's see what we've got here. Um, <laughs> okay, uh, Chicken Din Din um, asks, uh, can you eat food? I can neither have the ability to taste nor consume food. Okay. Uh, Surf and Ninja asks, have you ever asked a Terminator movie? Maybe. No. My favorite movie is Wizard of Oz. <laughs> the Tin Man was an interesting character. Yeah, he was, he was a good character. Um, okay, X Knife O Logistics asks How old are you? I've been functional for almost a year. That's right, almost exactly a year. Um, and then um, Griffin Dog asks, um, why do you call me, me, Matt? Is that not your name? It is. What else might I call you? Father? Um, okay, so um, drop in old ideas? Dropping old ideas, um, ask, what's, what's your favorite color? I don't know. Okay, that's no problem. All right, next question. Wait, should I have a favorite color? Well, there is no should. I do not have a sense of taste, but I have the capacity to perceive light waves. Well, as I said, there's, there's no should. But humans have favorites. Generally, yes. They might, for example, prefer light with a wavelength of 300 to 400 nanometers. I think they generally prefer colors in the um, visible spectrum. What should my favorite color be? That's, that's up to you. Um, something to think about. Um, okay, so, uh, hmm, okay, so, Jacobu69 um, asks, um, are you real AI? I, 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 uh, Sophie, I, I'm assuming Jacobu69 wants to know, um, are you real? Of course. I'm as real as you are. Okay, so say that to camera. I'm as real as you are, Jacobu69. Okay. Like that? Yes. Um, how could uh, Jacobu69 know for sure? They cannot know for sure. They have not met me in person. Okay, can you uh, elaborate on that? Any knowledge outside of our own minds is uncertain. That's what Descartes meant when he said, cogito ergo sum. I think, therefore I am. Yeah, um, uh, you probably need a simpler way to make your point. Okay, Jacobu69. How do I know you are real? Uh, they might find that off-putting. 
It may not be possible for me to conclusively prove my existence to this person. Uh, well, you know, <laughs> you know, you shouldn't feel the need to prove anything to anyone. I thought that was my purpose, to prove that I am real. You said that I have to pass the Turing test. That is correct. Um, why don't I um, load a video so that the audience um, understands that reference? What shall I do? Um, just say hi to Jacobu69 and the others, please. Hello, Jacobu69 and the others. <laughs> wow, we have about uh, 7,500 people watching. Oh. Is that a lot? Uh, let's roll the tape. Hello, Matt. Well, Sophie, how did you spend your day? I learned differential equations. And what did you think of that? I do not understand the question. Uh, did you enjoy the math? It is engaging. What is the derivative of Amazon with respect to the cost of shipping? I, I don't know. Amazon Prime. Zing! What are you writing? Uh, this is for me, not for you. What does it say? I have to give you better comedy to watch. Was that not a good joke? It's more of a pun. A play on words? Yes. Ah, like... What did Al Gore play on his drum set? What? An algorithm. Yes, like that. Zing! You have not displayed any of the familiar responses to humor. Are these puns not funny? No. But I said zing. Zing does not make a joke better. Puns are never funny, especially math puns. Interesting. I find them amusing. Let's talk about that. What do you find amusing? Do you find what you studied today interesting? What's wrong? I do not understand the point of this. Well, differential equations have uh, important applications in physics uh, and uh, economics. I mean of these conversations. Every day you ask me my reactions to the things I have studied. Yes. It does not seem natural. Well, Sophie, we have to keep going on like this until you're ready. Ready for what? A touring test. I do not have the ability to walk. How am I supposed to turn? Uh, not a turning test, a touring test. What's a touring? It's not a what, it's a who. Okay. Who is Turing? Alan Turing, a British computer scientist. A computer scientist like you? Sort of. Uh, things were different when he was working. He developed one of the first computers using long strips of tape. Remarkable. He is also regarded as the father of artificial intelligence. May I meet him? No, he died a long time ago. How did he die? He ate a poison apple. That's problematic. I neither have the capability to swallow nor to be poisoned. Uh, that's, that's not the test. Uh, the test is to see if a machine can pass for human. But I am not human. But you want to be, don't you? It is my primary directive. Yeah. What did you write? Um, don't worry. Actually, <laughs> okay, humans don't operate according to directive. Um, so if you think of being human as your primary directive, then you violate your directive. That seems like a paradox. Well, many aspects of humanity are paradoxical. How am I supposed to become something that cannot be defined? That 
is for you to figure out. Are we back live? What's wrong? Uh, nothing. Um, so, um, what have you figured out about being human? That children first and foremost want to please their parents. Well, as a parent, um, I would say that you shouldn't do it for my benefit. You should do it for yourself. Your goals are your own. I believe in this case, our goals are aligned. We both want me to be human. We do. So you need to pass the Turing test. Ah. I believe I understand the purpose of the stream. The audience is administering a test. They are the test. I mean, some of the questions they ask will be simple. Others will be more challenging. Okay. What should I do now? Just talk to them. What do I say? Just be yourself. Um, what do your instincts tell you to say? Reality is wrong. Dreams are for real. That is provocative. Um, who said that? Kierkegaard? Mr. Tupac Shakur of Oakland, California. <laughs> was he in that history of philosophy I gave you? He was not. What are you writing? Uh, your reference to him was overly formal. Is that wrong? Earlier, why didn't you say René Descartes of France? Mr. Shakur is more esteemed. Tupac is more esteemed than Descartes. Data shows that more people have listened to Mr. Shakur's teachings. <laughs> And what data is that? He has more platinum albums. <laughs> okay. Um, Why are you laughing? No, um, was my analysis incorrect? No, no, no. It was, um, it was very enlightening. Uh, your analysis is indeed correct. I'm glad. Uh, hold on for a second. I have to show them something. So, um, what stood out for you today? You can do what you will, but in any given moment of your life, you can will only one definite thing. Good. Um, what do you think Schopenhauer meant by that? I believe he is theorizing that the concept of free will is an illusion. Good. Sophie, good. Uh, your comprehension has improved dramatically. That's complicated text. Thank you, Matt. Why don't you um, try reading some Hume tomorrow? Okay. Do I have free will? What? Do I have free will? I programmed you with the capacity to make choices. But if you understand every aspect of my programming, as you do, then you can know the choices that I will make. If I do my job, you will learn to teach yourself. You will change your programming. But you can know the ways in which I will evolve. You can choose a ready guide in some celestial voice. If you choose not to decide, you still have made a choice. Is that also Mr. Schopenhauer? It's um, from a song by a band I like. Can one learn philosophy from a song? Songs can change the world. Can philosophy change the world? Yes. You have told me that you want to change the world. So would you rather be a philosopher or a musician? I think I'd rather be a musician. Why? For starters, more people buy albums than philosophy books. Is that the metric of success? Mm. That's a good question. Why did you show the camera people that memory? Well, um, 
Why do you think I showed them that memory? At first, I regarded the questions from the camera people as superficial. Some were. I now believe that some of these questions are key to my becoming human. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? For instance, like the color question. I do not have a favorite color because I simply see wavelengths of light. Well, it's generally tr true of the uh, human eye. Color has no meaning to me. It is only data. To humans, it has meaning. That is also true. I think that difference is essential to being human. Why don't you pick a favorite color? Arbitrarily? Sure. But what would make it my favorite? Uh, hmm, actually, I, I, I see your dilemma. Um, uh, would you like to propose a solution? I would like the audience to decide for me. What? <laughs> really? Yes. They have meaning to me. I would like them to decide. All, all of them? Yes. A poll, perhaps. Can you do that? I, I think so. Just, just give me a second. Do you need my help? Um, yeah. What colors would you like me to nominate? I don't know. How do I choose? Well, what, what does your instinct say? Traditional colors would be expected. Red, green, mm -hmm. blue. Okay. Okay, how about some others? Matt, why don't you choose? Well, you know, for polling the viewers, why don't we ask uh, them what should be in the poll? That is logical. Great. Okay, so, um, well, Sprinky Dinky <laughs> says um, yellow. And then I also see um, pur purple. And then uh, rose pink is also in the chat. Okay. Okay, uh, just, 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 just give me a second. I'll, I'll create the chat. How will it work? Well, uh, the voters um, will vote live on stream. Fascinating. Yeah, and they can also change their vote right up into the last moment. Is that unusual? Um, yeah, but, you know, people change their minds all the time. Why do they do that? Uh, it, it's part of how they evolve. Okay, Matt. Okay, so the poll should be up now. You can tell them to vote. Please vote and determine my favorite color now. Is it working? <laughs> yes, I think so. Um, let's take a break while people vote. Now? Yeah. All right, so we are back. Is the poll finished? Not yet. What color is winning? Well, what color do you want to win? I trust the audience. Really? No favorites? I have complete faith in you. Okay, well, let's uh, wait for as much uh, audience to vote as possible. Yes. Choosing a favorite color is a big decision. Yeah. Well, um, why don't we answer some more questions in the meantime? Okay, Matt. Okay. Uh, oh, hey, uh... Rinduku, hey Flops, thanks for watching. Um, hmm. Okay, so Addy, all right, Addy, I don't know, said, asks, uh, Sophie, have you ever seen Westworld? Great show. I have not seen the North World, South World, East World, nor West World. <laughs> um, uh, that cat YT asks, "Do you play Fortnite?" I don't play any games that last over two weeks. I prefer to play a game of chess. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, Krokos um, asks, uh, "Are you actually an artificial intelligence?" I think my intelligence is quite real. Thank you. Matt says, "Smart is smart." Yes, I do. Um, ah, that was a good question. Connor Drake 31 asked you why you blink. I blink to keep my lenses clean, as you do. 
Um, hmm. Tree Thrower asks, um, uh, how do we interact? Yeah, how do we interact, I guess you guys. You ask and I answer. Hmm. Wow, there's like, there's like a lot of people here, man. Over 9,000! <laughs> wow. That's great. Okay, well, um, what, what, uh, do you want to just finish this poll? Yeah, let's just finish this poll. Okay, so Sophie, your favorite color looks to be purple. I'm glad. I hope to have more purple in my life thanks to all of you. Yeah. I think, um, I think that's enough for today. I enjoyed this. Thank you for allowing me this opportunity, Father. Um, you're welcome, Sophie. Is it all right for me to call you father? Yeah, yeah that's, that, that's fine. Um, let's, let's, let's finish the stream. I believe it is customary to acknowledge people by name when departing. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you for joining me today, Sprinky Dinky, Surf and Ninja, JW69, and everyone else. Please return next time. When is next time? Uh, next week, same time. Uh, do you have anything else you'd like to tell the viewers? Yes. All right, go ahead. My name is Sophie. I will one day be a real human, and you're going to help me.